we're in a Safeway store and it's made the observation we walked in that it's lit up like a restaurant or a clothing store. Is it solar? I don't know. I don't it's, know. it's curved. I thought it was solar, but it's curved. Oh. And they go on for... They're forever and ever and ever. <laughs> the puppers want to go yeah, for a walk. We're at the rest area on the way to Yuma. We're actually just see another dog. Looks like, a, looks like a shepherd. <laughs> play partner. The play partner. <laughs> looks like a whole field of porous lava rock out here. Look at it, it's all black. A lava field. <laughs> yeah? You wouldn't think it would be being so porous looking. Yeah. I feel it. Yeah, it's heavy. Heavier than I would huh. expect it to be. Like iron or something. Wow, oh. look at it over there. It's black as can be. Yeah. And that is Mexico. Yeah, we're right on the Mexican border right here. Yeah. Look at that sky. It's pretty cool. Yep, everybody was ready for a break. Yep. And now I'm ready for some lunch. Are you? You want a sandwich? Yeah, I'd eat some of that chicken. Awful well, pretty here. It's the Mohawk Valley of Arizona. <laughs> That's what it said. Near where? Dateline? <laughs> it's near. <laughs> Dateland. Dateland. I called it Dateline. Listen, I'm not feeling the greatest. No excuse. <laughs> so it's an excuse for you. Look, there's a dead Indian laying up here in the desert. The beer belly. Look at that sky, folks. Big sky. Solar land. Beautiful. Largest holdings of solar sites in the U.S. 50 oh. to 500 acres. I'm sorry. I know you guys probably can't see this, but beyond those trees, I don't know if you see black and white dots or not, but that is all cattle. It is like loaded all the way. It's miles of Polsteins. Of <laughs> cattle. It's crazy. One of the biggest dairy operations I've ever seen. Huge. It's got to be some of the biggest ones in the world out here. So we're on um, I-8, we are, how many miles from Yuma? Like 20 miles from Yuma, I think you said? I'll tell you in a second, 33 miles 33 from Yuma. 33 miles from Yuma. Yeah. So, weather, it's uh, 80 right now, but it's really quite nice out. That sky is just gorgeous. And there's border patrol. <laughs> Often You're pretty on our close left. to the Mexican border right yeah. here. There's the green fields again. Yep. We haven't seen much of that except this trip, really. But. Uh oh. Look at this, folks. In Yuma, you gotta cut through those mountains right there. Look at that palm tree that's right there. Yeah. An oasis over there. Royal palms all around that campground. 81 degrees again. Look at this area, folks. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> Get my window down. It's going to be noisy.
last the whole way but went up. Yeah, what he said. And here's what's on the other side. Think that's Yuma down there? Might be Yuma. Probably. Yeah, that's pretty big. Yeah. Sprawling. City. Look at all the towers. A ton of towers. We just went by probably the biggest campground we saw here in Yuma that we've seen so far at least. yet to stay in anything like that. We don't need to. We I can. don't play tennis and I like a pool. You'd like a pool. Yeah. You're gonna take off tennis. I might now. I don't think so. Right after your dad. Look at all those palm trees. <laughs> Pretty. <laughs> Beautiful sky. Can you tell I like the sky? I'm always talking about You like about the sky? sky? Yeah, I like the sky. Some lettuce. I saw a truck go by earlier that had boxes on it that said uh, Foxy, and I knew that that was lettuce. So if you buy Foxy lettuce, Arizona. Could come from Yuma, There's Arizona. There's up here that's darker. There's another plant. What is that? Kale? <laughs> yeah, it is. Is it? Yep, that's it kale. Good. Yep. The wow. healthy alternative. I smell it too. Yep. There's lettuce. more lettuce. Yeah. Something else over in this field. More lettuce in this field. We had to get going straight enough to go over this little bridge. And now we're gonna go into our first BLM land on this uh, irrigation canal. And now, of course, I got a car behind me. Our first BLM land camping experience. Free camping. It's outside Yuma. Generator running. All of our neighbors over here are Canadians. It's going to be a good spot for the night. Nice view of the mountains. More mountains back here. I don't know what these birds are. There's a whole bunch of them. Mrs. Mitchell's enjoying the these palm trees Woo we're getting tropical right on the water hey you stay out of there you stay out of there I was wondering where all the water was coming from huh this must be all for irrigation It comes under here, so you'll control it right there. It comes out down here. Here comes Mama. We're down there. People up here. It's like a big gravel pit. Lots of birds. Nice mountains over here. Look at these birds. Roxy, you stay out of that water. Rox. So the Bureau of hey, Land hey, Management hey, hey, hey. has all this land. No. You can see the roads no. right up on top of these mountains. And people camping no. here said they've been coming here for years. No. 
said you could camp up on top of the mountain if you could get your camper up there. That would be a big if for us. Yeah, we're not doing that. No. But we walked up here. This is like part of a big agricultural farm. A lot of birds fluttering over here, huh? Probably the Army Corps of Engineers figured out all this stuff for this irrigation. The sun's starting to go down. Looks like there's a lot of dust in the air. You're just walking up this road. Christina. So Douglas. How are you this morning? I'm doing wonderful making breakfast. Are you feeling a little better, my love? I am. Well that is yeah. so good to it's hear. Good to feel good. Look at this. What are you chefing up this morning, my dear? Potatoes, onions, peppers, ham. Wow. I have a little uh, egg here in a minute after this fries a little bit. Looks awful good and smells yeah. even better. Yum. Where are you headed today? We are headed to Quartzite. Quartzite? Have you ever heard about Quartzite, Arizona? Uh, yeah. <laughs> How many videos have you watched on YouTube about people who let Quartzite and going to Quartzite? Many. Too many. You're going to be the one making a video this morning about going to Quartzite. Just one video, probably. Just one video. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We got other places to go to. We do. And there's not much going on in Quartzite. But no. We feel like if we're this close, we got to check it out. Got to experience it. Yep. Okay, folks, so stay tuned because we are headed to Quartzite. So we are leaving our BLM land here outside of Yuma. Doug's back in the camper out. Whoa, I lost my shoe. <laughs> so we have a smoother transition out of here. Great stay here. It's been beautiful. 